Hi, this is Daniel Hutchins, and today we're going to be talking about a little bit of uh, information from our friends BleedingCool.com. So, okay, so today from BleedingCool.com, we're going to be talking about Magneto. So, Marvel Comics is to publish the trial of Magneto in August. Now, earlier this year, Marvel has teased a number of upcoming X-Men titles, and one of them was going to be the trial of Magneto. Um, so, it has been suggested to us that this may well be the way to deal with Wanda Maximoff, the Scarlet Witch, and her supposed crimes against the mutant nation of Kokoa. We noted that this way of X will be heading hard in the territory too. And could they put her in on a dock? No, but it still may come up because this is the trial of Magneto. Once thought to be Wanda Maximoff's father. Okay, so there's this picture below of the trial of Magneto. Okay, so trial of Magneto is going to be published in August. Magneto has been a prominent figure in X-Men comics for many years, a member of the Quiet Council of Kakoa, and one of the central figures can now be subject to a trial, just as he is subject to others. Magneto is a man who has committed mass murders, but so have many others of the Quiet Council. Which of these laws of Kakoa will he be accused of breaking? Odds are, it will be kill no man. But those rules do not apply to mutants, and they can now be resurrected. Might they also apply to Scarlet Witch, now that she's no longer a mutant? Magneto, what did you do to Wanda? Okay, this is a mindless speculation, but it might suggest that some of the more morally questionable residents of Kakoa might be getting a little payback for some of their crimes. Now Marvel calls this the trial that threatens to divide mutant kind. With more information coming next week. This promotional artwork is by John Romita Jr. We told you that there are big plans for Marvel Comics. So you know, the last time they had a trial of Magneto was back in Uncanny X-Men number 200. When Sir James Jaspers turned up I wondered if he will make a repeat appearance. Hmm, John Romita Jr. do the trial Magneto as well. What goes around comes around. Just like karma, bitches. So like I said, anyway, there's also pictures down below about the Uncanny X-Men number 200 by John Romita Jr. And there's a bunch of taglines. Taglines, comics, Marvel Comics, John Romita Jr., Kokoa, Marvel's Tribe, Magneto, and X-Men. And a little bit about Witch Johnson. Founder of Bleeding Cool, the longest serving digital news reporter in the world since 1992. Author of the Flying Friar, Hold Up, The Avenged Frolls, Doctor Who, Womb of Deja Vu, The Many Murders of Miss Crane Run, Chase Variant, Lives in Southwest London, Works from Blacks on Dean Street, Shops and Piranhas Comics, and Father of Two, political cartoonist. Now that last little bit was just a little bit about the history of the founder of the website I'm using, uh, BleedingCool.com. So, if you guys like this content, please hit a thumbs up if you like. If you didn't, that's okay. Let me know what your thoughts are about the trial of Magneto. And again, if you guys, make sure you subscribe if you haven't yet, and have a nice night. Bye.